Hey everyone, welcome to Saturday's Rip. In today's Saturday's Rip, I have five blasters of 2024 uh, Fanatics um, update blasters. So, so excited to get into that with you guys. Should be a pretty fun and exciting rip. You do get Aqua Parallel, so hopefully I can pull a Paul Skeens rookie card. Redemption would be awesome, or just any sweet hit. Um, I've done really well with these in the past. So stay tuned, guys. Should be a pretty awesome rip. Hey everyone, Moonlight Rips here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys had an awesome Saturday today. Uh, today, for Saturday's rip, I'm going to be getting into these 2024 Tops Update Fanatics Blaster boxes. There's Yamamoto and Imanaga on the front. Um, you do get more cards in these blasters than you do retail um, blasters. You also do get the Aqua Parallels in here as well. Um, I love to pull a Fanatics Authentic Memorabilia Re Redemption. That would be super freaking amazing if I could do that. Um, it says Chase Rare Heavy Lumber Cards. Here's some of the parallels if you want to look look at those. Uh, you can real quick. Let them cook. Autumn Tales, All-Star Games, Top Splat, Gold, and Heavy Lumber. If you want to see more odds and uh, some of the hits, go to tops.com to check out the um the hits as well and a quick update for you guys i will be doing another video after saturday's rip i actually got my um autograph from my jumbo box I wanted to keep you posted on that I actually got it in the mail it was very quick they sent it to me really fast so i will do the autograph reveal probably later saturday evening so stay tuned for that as well um should be pretty exciting I, I don't know who the auto is but like i said they shipped it to me fast so i will do an auto reveal from my 2024 update jumbo box um just to let you guys know keep you guys informed that i did get my auto so i will be revealing that and seeing it for the first time myself as well hopefully it's a nice auto um you get i believe nine packs 12 cards per pack for a total of 108 cards which you get a lot more in these and you do the retail um blasters i think those you get 74 if i'm not mistaken so you get quite a bit more cards they are a little bit more expensive but not by much overall these have been really good to me so hopefully this luck will continue um, these will run you 30 dollars on fanatics.com whereas the regular typical blasters retail are 25 maybe 27 with tax um, so not a bad value um, these have always like i said been good to me in the past if you haven't checked out my previous fanatics rip i did for series two i did really well surprisingly when i bought four so i'm hoping fingers crossed i pull a redemption would be amazing um so yeah let's get into this guys enough of me chatting and let's see what these fanatics are all about i'm hoping i pull a nice redemption a nice hit um love to pull something crazy for you guys um so yeah i hope i do really well i'm hoping um that these fanatics are good to me i hope you guys enjoyed uh front fun day fridays rip i did really well with the hangers um so yeah that was a fun and exciting rip i definitely love update it's been pretty good so far so without without further ado let's get into this guys i will probably do um hits rookies over here and then main hits we'll put in the front and center so first look at 2024 tops fanatic blasters 108 cards per pack let's see how we do first blaster um, wish me luck, guys. I'm hoping I pull a nice hit. Love to pull a redemption for you guys. If you have to pull one, it'd be nice if I could. Um, won't spend a whole lot of time on the base or the rookies. We'll just get right into the good stuff. Blaster number one. Let's do this, guys. Hopefully, this will be an amazing rip. Hopefully, I do pull something crazy during the packs. Um, so, let's see how we do. It's blaster number one. The packs right there. Let's get into this, guys. Wish me luck. Like I said, love, love, love to pull a redemption card for you guys. Um, I see your aqua coming up. So we'll do the rookies over there. And we'll do the hits right there. The main hits we'll put up front. And let's see how we do with this fanatics rip. Oh, we do have a backwards card to start thinking. Oh, it oh, an independence day nice these things are freaking loaded so we got an independence day right off the bat um let's see who it is nelson velezquez to 76 nice we're already starting off with a bang we already got a independence day nice that's a nice photo too of velezquez 
these are nice looking carbs. Um, that's a nice shot of him sliding in. I don't know what base it is, but very nice hit to start things off, guys. We're off to a very, very good start. A, a number card to 76. Nice. Yeah, I think in my last rip, the blasters came in big time in the final blaster of Fanatics. They definitely came in in the end. So very nice start. Very, very nice. We got a low number card. Start things off. I'll take it. Wish it was a bigger name, but these Independence Day cards are super sharp looking. They have a foil look to them. So the red, white, and blue, the flag. Very nice looking. You can see it. It's kind of foilish. Sharp looking card. Not a bad start, guys. Very nice. Nice landscaping card, too. Looks good with the red, white, and blue flag in the background. So not bad, guys. Very happy. So off to a good start. Hopefully this keeps going. Man, I'd love to pull a redemption card for you guys. That would be super sick. Nice Velezquez. So we have our next cards coming up. Um, sorry if that glare is in the way. Hope you guys can see it. And we have a Mystical. It is of Sunny Gray. Not a bad one there. I love these Mysticals. We have a Shoyotani on the All-Star. That's a nice one there. Definitely sleeve that one up. He had a heck of a season this year winning the championship. So then we'll get into the... I don't know if you get one per pack, Stars of MLB, or if you get... I mean, not Stars of MLB. I mean, Aqua. I don't know if you get one uh, Aqua per pack or you get one per box. I'm not exactly sure. From what I've heard or read, it seemed like you get one per box, but I hope it's one per pack, or several per pack. So, nice show Otani on the All-Star card. Our favorite cards of the whole rip, stars the MLB, JK, LOL, Jackson Churio, and we have one. Alan, Trey, Treo, on the Aqua, so... Definitely get these aquas sleeved up. They're nice looking cards. Very nice. So, no rookie, unfortunately. I'm hoping you get one per pack. I'm hoping. From what I read, it seemed like they were one per box, but I hope that's not the case. But overall, not bad. All right, let's get into pack number two. Off to a good start with a Independence Day. Very, very nice pull. Um, so far, I'm happy. Uh... Very, very happy with this rip so far. Um, love to play. Uh, Paul Skeens, a parallel would be nice. We don't, as this might be an all-star card. Nope, it is not. I thought maybe it was. Sometimes they have them in their regular uniforms. So we have our favorite cards of the rip. Anthony Volpe, stars at MLB. And our aqua is a Tyler Nevin. So these aquas are super sharp. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know if the camera does it justice. But these are very awesome, beautiful looking cards. I love the aquas. I love that Tops and Fanatics have that going. Um, they are nice, nice looking cards. So nothing too crazy in that pack, which is okay. We'll get into the next one, guys. Keep this going. We have four more blasters to go through. Hopefully I can try to speed this up a little bit quicker. Um, let's see what we got here. I believe you do get one per pack. I thought it was one per box. From from where I read or heard somewhere, um, it was one per box, but I'm glad that's not the case. There's a nice Jackson Merrill. Put him here. We have Willie Mays on the 89. Um, we have a favorite card of the rip. Royce Lewis, stars of MLB, and a Joey Loperfido rookie card. So that's a nice one there. Loperfido on the rookie. Nice ways to get a rookie in the Aqua. So get this sleeved up. And the there's another one I wanted to get sleeved up as well. I guess maybe not. The Willie Maze is a nice insert too. I do like that as well. Um nope. Okay, that would that would be it. Okay. Let's see what we got next. Okay, next pack up, guys. 
Can we get more hits? Can we get another banger? Let's see how we do, guys. Uh, we have a backwards card. Louis Varlin. Rainbow Foil. And we have an all-star, Trey Turner. And our favorite cards of the rip, stars of the MLB, Cody Bellinger. And our aqua is a Carlos Carrasco. So, let me get this rainbow sleeved. And we'll continue this rip and the aqua. So, i got to get both of those. Um, okay, guys. Um, let's see what we got here. Okay, let's get this aqua and rainbow sleeved. I'm just going to sleeve all the parallels, most of them, like the rainbows and the aquas. Because you never know. Some collector out there might want a particular card. And so, yeah. If I eventually sell them at some point, which I haven't got to that point yet. Okay, so we did get a rainbow foil, so not bad. I think it's our first rainbow foil of the rip. Okay, let's get into the next pack, guys. Come on, love to play redemption, man. That would be super, super sick. I don't know what I'd do if I hit a redemption. Probably go crazy. Those are nice, nice hits. Okay, let's see. And rookie, rookie. Oh, we have a let him cook. It is Julio Rodriguez. Nice one there. And our favorite cards of the rip. Davis Schneider, stars MLB. And our Aqua Jose Trevino is our Aqua. So continue this. Give me one sec. I'll put these guys in here. I do like the let him cook parallels as well. Those are nice. Parallels. Nice Julio. I don't think it is numbered. Nope, it is not. So, okay, so it's nice getting some variety of hits in these. I feel like the retail ones, you rarely get them per pack. I feel like these are a little bit more gen generous than the um, actual retail. Um, parallels. Sorry, give me one sec. I'm just kind of separating this. Okay, let me get this. Uh, I think I'm good right there. Okay. Did I get the aqua? I think I did get the aqua sleeved up. Okay, so we should be good. Um, Okay, there we go. Let's get into the next pack, guys. Sorry about the delay. All right, wish me luck, guys. See if we can pull the next pack. Love to pull a banger. The White Langford. favorite card of our rip Shota Imanaga stars at MLB and our aqua is a Kyle McCann that's a nice one nice rookie there to get it's always nice to get rookies in these stars at MLB as always um, whenever you get a rookie in a parallel you never know when that player is going to take off or do really well so it's just nice to get parallels and rookies and parallels I should say Okay, so we got two rookies in the aqua, which is nice. Um, let's get, we got three packs left, guys. Let's see how we do in these last three. It feels a little thicker. I'm hoping there's some, some goodies in here. There's something good. Could be a chrome. Um, could be something good. Never know. Let's see, guys. Let's see what we can find in here. Jared Jones, rookie. Um, we 
have a Evan Carter on the 89. It's a nice one there. All-Star, Juan Soto. And a Juan Soto. Favorite cards of the rip. Start of the MLB. Our Aqua is a Kevin Pillar. Or Pilar. Sorry if I butchered your name. I don't know if it's Pillar or Pilar. So, nice Evan Carter. I'll get that sleeved up. 89. And the Aqua. Man. Yeah, I did really well with Series 2. Those, those Fanatics Blasters were amazing. I'm hoping these carry over and are really well too. So far, they are starting out very, very well. So, starting off really, really good. Um, so, very happy with these pulls so far. Okay, guys. Um, two packs left. Let's see how we can do with these last two. And blaster number one. Let's see. Um, Junior Caminero. There's a nice one there. Um, come on, something crazy. We got a blue coming up. Nationals, Nick Senzel on the blue, Anthony Rizzo, his favorite card of the rip, and we have a Cole Colin Holderman. Too bad that wasn't a Paul Skeens, but it's okay. All right, guys, last pack of blaster number one. We'll get right in to blaster number two. Um, let me get the blue and the aqua sleeved. So far, what I'm seeing, you definitely get a lot of parallels in these, which are amazing um they're definitely worth the money i definitely feel like just out of the first blaster i it's safe to say that that was definitely an awesome first blaster to get a independence day those are very hit hard to hit out of just regular retail so thank you fanatics for doing an amazing job on keeping these hits going and making this rip a lot of fun these fanatics are Nothing but amazing, so I'm definitely happy with these. Okay, guys. So, we got one more pack, guys, and then we'll get into blaster number two. There we go, guys. Can we end blaster one with a huge hit or a bang? We'll see. Oh, 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 I see Paul Skeens. Oh, my gosh. I fucking did it. Let's go, baby. I think if it's an Aqua, I think it is a Paul Skeens. Oh my gosh, I think I might have did it, guys. Let's go, baby. I think I hit the Paul Skeens Aqua. I'm hoping, 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 hoping. Hoping that's what's in the back. I'm hoping it is, and I believe it is a Paul Skeens. Ooh, nice Mickey Mantle on the Topps Black Gold. Nice one there. Curtis Mead, and let's go, baby. Boom, Paul Skeens Aqua. Let's freaking go, baby. What a nice hit. Wow. That is definitely going to be graded. What a nice hit. Centering looks good. Card looks good. What a beautiful looking card. Man, I was hoping to hit this card. Wow, what a banger, guys. Holy shit, guys. Man, these fanatics are a fire guys we got an independence day and the paul skeens aqua on the very first blaster what more can you ask for and we got a mickey mantle on the tops black gold i mean wow these things are fire what can i say guys let's go baby paul skeens aqua man that is sick i am super happy that's a nice mickey mantle too on the tops black gold I do love, sorry about the focus, do love these cards a lot. Man, I am super stoked. I, I couldn't ask for anything more. I either wanted a Paul Skeens Auto, a Paul Skeens Parallel, or Redemption card. So, man, guys, that is absolutely amazing. Um, absolutely freaking amazing. A hit of all hits. Paul Skeens 
Aqua. Wow. That is amazing, guys. Wow. I am in shock. That is freaking awesome. That is amazing. I hit it, guys. Finally hit the Paul Skeens Aqua. Making sure I, I'm going to make sure I cut this sleeve really, really careful so it has a nice cut in it. That's perfect. What a beautiful looking card. Yes, what a beautiful looking card. Paul Skeens Aqua. Wow. Of all players to get, what a beautiful looking card. It really pops with the yellow and the aqua. Man, yeah, these things are absolutely amazing. Wow, what a hit, guys. So now I have my orange crackle and I have an aqua pulse skeins. Let's freaking go. Boom. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Sorry about the camera focus. Um, I don't know why it's not focusing very good but wow i don't know like i'm having trouble with the camera sorry guys i apologize um i don't know it's acting funny for some reason um man give me one sec guys hopefully there we go paul skeen's aqua let's go boom wow what a nice looking card that is a beautiful looking card Everything looks good. The corners look good. Um, yeah, that's that's a sharp looking card. So, so happy to hit that. Man, I was wondering if I'd ever hit a Paul Skeens Aqua. And sure enough, I did. Man, that is a nice looking card. I am super stoked, guys. Like I said, the corner looks good. Everything looks good. Man, that is the hit of all hits you could possibly want. Other than the redemption card, yeah. Man, I'm going to have to try to speed this up. What a first blaster, guys. What a banger of a blaster. Wow. Finally hit a Paul Skeens. All right, let's get into blaster number two. That was very, very exciting. Man, I don't think you can ask, ask much more than that. Independence Day, a Paul Skeens. So many other hits as well. Man, now all I need to hit is a redemption card and auto. Man, I'd be set. Preferably the Redemption. Man, I'd love to hit one of those. Oh, those things are amazing. All right, guys. Blaster number two. Start off with pack number one. Let's keep this going. Sorry if I spent a lot of time on that. I was just very happy and excited. Just enjoying it. Couldn't believe I hit the Paul Skeens. Of all players. Man. That is amazing. Favorite card of the rip. O'Neill Cruz, stars of MLB. And our aqua, aqua is Miguel Sano. So I'll try to kind of speed things up. If you guys were hesitant on buying Fanatics, definitely go out and get you some if they're still available online. Highly, 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 highly recommend you get some um, fanatics. They are a lot of fun. Not guaranteed you're going to get hits in every one, but the chances are definitely there. And as you can see, I've done really well with just one blaster. So I pretty much paid for everything, which I'm very happy, very, very happy with these pulls. Man, can we keep the streak going? Can I get a redemption? We'll find out, guys. We have a Junior Caminero in the 89. That's a nice one there. Favorite cards of the rip. Jung Hu Lee and Stars of MLB. And our Aqua is a Manuel Margot. So, we've got two to sleeve up. And we'll get this, continue with this rip. Wow. That is amazing, guys. I didn't think I'd hit it. I was so happy I did. Okay, guys. Um, let me get these in here, and I'll be with you in a sec. All 
Let's see. Okay, guys. Next pack. Uh, let's see what we got here. There's a nice Jackson Merrill. We have a blue Jared Walsh. Nice color match there. There we go with our favorite card of the rips. Spencer Torkelson, Torkelson started the MLB. And our Aqua is a Blaze Alexander. I actually pulled his rainbow in Friday, Funday Friday's rip. So that's a nice looking card in the Aqua. Blaze Alexander. Nice looking card. I like that photo of him. Nice looking card there. And it's nice with the Aqua too. I, I know the uh, Diamondbacks have done the, the jerseys where they have had Aqua in them. So very nice hit there. I'll take it. Not a huge hit, but still, nonetheless, it's a nice one um, to get. Get this blue Jared Walsh, and I will be with you guys. Oh, for the Blaster 2. I don't know if you can beat Blaster 1. I don't know. That is really going to be tough to beat. Really, really tough. But you never know, guys. So I have a few more packs left of Blaster number two. Let's get into this. Hopefully, get another banger. Let's see if I can pull something crazy. Uh, so this one. Um, we do have a backwards card. It is oh, is this a? Mother Father's Day? Wow, to 25. Oh man. Adam Adovino. Adovino to 25. Is this a Mother's Day or Father's Day? Oh nice. It is a camo. Ooh, that is sick looking. What a nice hit there. There's a camo. This is the first time I hit one of these. Adam Adovino. Nice. What a nice camo. Wow. Man, I don't know. This is going to be tough. These are like neck and neck. It's my, probably my lowest card I've ever hit before. A camo to 25. That is a sick looking card. Man, that is sharp. I don't know, guys. This is a toss up. Hmm. I honestly don't know who to. I don't know. This is tough. That's a nice looking card, too. With the Mets and the camo. It's a sick looking card. Adam Adovino on the camo number to 25. Wow. I'll tell you what. These things are on fire. So not bad there. We have a mystical right after that. It is Gunnar Henderson. Nice one there. Marcus Simeon on the all-star. Favorite cards of the rip. Adley Rutschman stars the MLB. And our aqua is a Alex Visa. Visia on the aqua so wow guys just wow a camo an independence day the paul skeins parallel i mean yeah you i don't know how you can get much better than that it's just absolutely amazing and like i said unless i pull that redemption yeah okay let me get these two sleeved up and we'll continue this okay guys Wow, I am just blown away by these Fanatics Blasters. Yeah, I... Like I said, the only thing I really want to hit is an auto or redemption. And I'm set. I'm already happy. Like, this has been outstanding of a rip. Pull that Paul Skeens. I am ha so happy with that. If any card to get, that would probably be the one to get right now. Okay, it's got Aqua, I'll put him in there, and we will continue this rip, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying these Fanatics Blasters as much as I am ripping them for you. Um, let's get into the next one, guys. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, I seen that Paul Skeens in the back. I was like, oh my gosh, I couldn't believe it. I wasn't for sure if that was going to be the Aqua, and sure enough, it was on the back. It looks like we have a Chrome coming up. No, I haven't got too many chromes this series. Um, 
Young Hu Lee. That's a nice one there. I'll take that chrome. It's a little bent a little bit, a little warped, but it's okay. And our favorite card of the rip, Nolan Chanel, start of the MLB. Our Aqua is a Kyle Muller. So um got to, we'll get the Young Hu Lee sleeved up because it is a chrome. Those usually tend to be a little bit more valuable than the base. Um they, send, they tend to seem to hold more interest in collectors than the base does. For some reason, people want to collect the chrome ones. They are nicer looking. They just have that sheen and that sharpness look to them. They're definitely nice looking cards um, compared to the base. They definitely look a lot, lot better. So, Okay, guys. Getting down to the last few packs of blaster number two. Let me know down below in the comment section which blaster you thought won. Um, let's get into the next pack. Looks like we have four packs left of blaster number two. Um, let's see. Can we? Can blaster two beat out blaster number one? It's pretty close, I would say right now. It's pretty close. I don't know. I think blaster one is in the lead barely. Barely in the lead. We have a backwards card. Wyatt Langford, nice 89 parallel there. Favorite card of the rip, Jackson Churio, stars of the MLB. And our Aqua is a Joey Loperfido on the Aqua rookie card. So, like I said, blaster number one to me is in the lead just barely. But, like I said, we'll see how these last three packs go. Because, I mean, I pulled that... Independence Day and the Paul Skeens, yeah, to me that's just, that sealed the deal. But, that camo is a sharp looking card, and it's a low number two. So, let's see guys, three packs left, can blaster number two take the lead? This, um, let's see what we got here. I feel like you get more rookies and parallels than you do base cards, which are really, really nice. We have a backwards card, rookie combos, nice. Matt Crook and David Venulos, Venulos on the rainbow. That's a nice one there, the rainbow. And we have a Seth Lugo. On the all-star favorite cards of the rip, Anthony Volpe stars the MLB and a Brent Sutter Suter or Suter on the Aqua. Get these in there. Two packs left, guys. Two packs left. Okay. Let me get this aqua and rainbow sleeved and I will be with you guys. left guys how can we finish off this second blaster hopefully really strong hopefully all right guys next pack can we finish blaster number two let's see what we can do can we hit a redemption card i don't know i'm hoping keep my fingers crossed Keeping my fingers crossed. Get something. We have a Cal Ripken Jr. I think this is an all city. I could be wrong. Or American class, maybe. Could be it. That might be American class. I think that's what those are. Cal Ripken Jr. Favorite cards of the rip. Start of the MLB. Royce Lewis. Inner Aqua is a 
Kevin Kiermeyer. So last pack, guys. Blaster number two. Um, I don't know unless this, uh, unless there's something in this last pack. I think blaster to me, blaster number one is in the lead. Um, I think it would have to take the lead. Unfortunately, I want it to be close, but I don't think it's going to be. Not after those two big pulls out of that first one. I don't think you can top that. Okay, guys. Last pack out of blaster number two. Last pack of magic out of blaster number two. Can we make something happen? Can we get a nice hit to end this second blaster? Let's see, guys. Can we finish strong? Let's see, guys. White Langford. Um, ooh, we have a gold. Nice. Brewers. Sal Frelick. Nice one there. I'll take that. Rookie debut. Cody Bellinger. Favorite cards of the Rip Stars at MLB. And our Aqua is a Nolan Chanel. So, do we get him? Nope. I thought we got him. So, not bad. Um, Still, I think... Blaster number one is definitely in the lead right now. Still, no question about it. Still got some nice pulls on Blaster two, but nothing comes close to the first one. Hope you guys enjoyed Blaster number two. Let me get this. Um, sleeved and I'll get into blaster number three. I'll try to go a little faster in these last three. Okay, guys. Uh, da -da -da -da. Nice Sal Frelick on the gold. I'll take it. Too bad that wasn't a Paul Skeens, but it's okay. Um, blaster number three, guys. Um, let's see what we can do. Blaster three. Oh, come on. We want an auto for redemption. We want to make it happen. Call it into existence. Come on. Something crazy, guys. Come on. Come on. Something crazy, guys. Let's make it happen. This is blaster number three, guys. Let me fix my camera real quick. It kind of got out of... There we go. Sorry guys, I apologize. Camera got a little messed up, a little wonky. Um, oh man, I might have to, sorry, I might have to adjust this a little bit better. There we go. Um, sorry, I apologize guys, I'm trying to move this. Bear with me guys. Um, Get it so it's adjusted good. Okay, um, let me just try to move it so a little bit better. Wonder how that is, if that's better, guys. Um, sorry. Crap. Um help a lot. Sorry guys, I apologize. Trying to get this set up so it looks somewhat decent. Maybe that's why the camera wasn't focusing very good. Because the cam the There we go. That seems a little bit better. Okay, guys. Sorry about that. I apologize. Blaster number three, my fault. Trying to get this so it looks good shot of everything. Um, let's go blaster number three. Jackson Holiday. Evan Carter. Ooh, what is this? 
Oh, what is this, guys? Let him cook is a parallel, I believe. It's a backwards card. I think it's blue. So it's not numbered, but it is a parallel. A Bryce Harper. Nice. You can tell it's blue in the background. Um, so it is backwards. So that is nice. Okay. Not bad. I'll take it. First look at the parallel in that. Haven't hit a parallel. And we got a Bobby Witt Jr. on the 89. As you can see, uh, the Let Him Cook are normally just the white. And then this is a blue one of some sort. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely a parallel for sure. Um, we got a Bobby Witt on the 89. We got an all star for Nando Tatis behind that. Let me get this in the stack and I'll show you guys the rest of these. For Nando Tatis, all star, David Schneider, stars MLB. We all know the role. Favorite cards of the rip. And a Brewers Aqua Chris Waller. So that's not bad there. Nice to get a rookie on the Aqua. So not bad there. Not too shabby. Got a parallel and let him cook. We got a rookie in the aqua. So not bad. Not a bad start. Okay, guys. Let's get into the next pack Junior Caminero nice one there Shota Imanaga and we have a Michael Taylor on the Aqua Okay, guys, let's keep this going. Okay, guys, let's see. These parallels are getting a little high. Let's stop this for sure. Come on, can we get a huge hit out of blaster number three? Let's see. There might be a tops gold, black gold in here. I'm thinking there might be. Um... Nice of the Paul Skeens. Don't know. Um, let's see what we got here. It is a Topps Black Gold. It is Ronald Acuna Jr. Juan Soto, favorite card of the Rip Stars MLB. And her Aqua is. That's a nice one there. Korean Pair Sparks NL. So, not bad. Hey, Seon Kim and Young Hoo Lee. So. Get those two sleeved up. Okay. Let's see what we got next. I do love these tops black gold. These are sharp looking cards. Probably one of my favorite in the update series set by far. Definitely, definitely like those cards a lot. Um, okay, guys. Get to the next pack. Definitely getting some nice stuff out of these for sure. All right, guys. And we hit a redemption. Let's make it happen, guys. Let's make it happen. We have a blue coming up. Twins pillar. Twins pillar. And we have an Aaron Judge. There's a nice all-star card there. 
you know the role. Anthony Rizzo, stars of the MLB. Your favorite card is the Rip. And a Sal Frelick, again, on the rookie debut. So, it's a nice Aaron Judge. Get those two sleeved up. Him and Otani are probably going to be the MVPs of the series, I'm thinking. Although Juan Soto did have a heck of a series, so did Giancarlo Stanton as well. I don't know. But I think as far as the... For the... Uh, Tops Chrome, the rookie. I think those are going to be the two finalists. Let me do. Let me find that self relic. I think we hit his already. Um. Yep. Yeah, no, I don't think we did. Take that back. But we did his self relic. Maybe it was in a different parallel. I think it was. Okay, guys. So, um, unfortunately, we didn't get him in the aqua. Okay, guys. Try to go a little faster. Let's see what we can do here. <laughs> Come on. Something big. Something big. Come on. It's a Colin Kowser. Um. Paul Skeens, and we have an 89, L.A. De La Cruz, there's a nice one there, Curtis Mead, you know the deal, and a Yuki Matsui, rookie card on the Aqua. It's a nice Ellie, 89. Take it. I mean, if I could just pull an auto, man, that would be nice. Just pull an auto. Hmm. I don't know, guys. I'm hoping. There is still hope. Still hope for an auto. Okay, guys. How many packs? Looks like we have four left in Blaster. Number three. Okay. So four packs left and three. Can we get an auto? Not sure. Um, so we have another Mystic Gold, I think, coming up. Nope, it's a Chrome. O'Neill Cruz on the Chrome. We have a backwards card. Eddie Rosario on the Rainbow Foil. It's a nice looking photo there. Looks like he's bunting right there. That's a pretty cool looking shot there. Colin Kowser, favorite card of the rip. Start of the MLB and a Michael Ciani. Ciana, I was thinking Ciani. So nothing crazy there. It's okay. Um, we did get a chrome, so I got three to sleeve up. Just give me one sec. And we'll get into these last three packs. Blaster number three. Sorry if this video goes longer than I anticipated. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to speed things up a little bit more. Making sure I don't miss anything. So we did get we have two chromes already. And a ton of hits, man. There's a lot of hits in these. Let's see, guys. All right. Um, let me get the rainbow foil in there, and I'll be with you guys. Okay. All right. Three packs left of blaster number three. Come on. Get, ooh, I think we have a blue shimmer coming up. Ellie De La Cruz, rookie debut. Nice one there. Take that. Um, ooh, 
There's our blue shimmer right here. P. Crow Armstrong. Nice. Boom. Let's go, baby. Look at that looking card. Oh, wow. That is a sick looking card. What a sharp looking card there to $9.99. What a nice color match, too. What a beautiful looking card. P. Crow Armstrong Blue Shimmer to $9.99. That is sick. That is a sick looking card. Man, that is fire. Wow, that is a beautiful looking card. I don't know what's more nicer looking. That or the Paul Skeens. I think this might be it. That is sharp with the blue. Everything just pops. The Cubs logo, the rookie logo. That is a sick looking card. That is definitely grade worthy. For sure. That is a sharp looking card. That is sick. I definitely will, definitely, definitely will get that um, graded for sure. Absolutely. Um, wow, that is a beautiful looking card, like I said. Wow, that is a beauty of a card. What a nice looking card there. So, not bad. And we have a Autumn Tales of Alex Bregman. Carlos Correa, I think it's an all-star, yep, and you know the deal, Austin Wells' favorite cards of the rip, and a Brewers, Joe Ross, so not a bad pull there, guys, nothing crazy, but still a nice looking card, very, very nice, wish it was a, like a Paul Skeens would have been better, but like I said, I cannot complain, that is a super, super sharp looking card. Not gonna lie, that is a sick looking card. That is, I just like, wow, that is a beautiful looking card. Okay, let me get this aqua. We got two packs left, and let's see if we can pull these last two guys. So far, some nice pulls, very, very nice. I really don't have a favorite as per se. That Paul Skeens is up there, but man, that P. Crow Armstrong, wow, that thing is fire. That thing is a beautiful looking card. That looks amazing. And that, that like I said, the video and the camera doesn't do it justice. Okay, two packs left, guys. Can we pull something crazy? Let's do it, guys. Let's make it happen. Ooh, Jason Dominguez, is this an Aqua? Ooh, this will be a nice one. If it is what I'm thinking what it is. Jason Dominguez on the Aqua, that would be nice too. Um, uh, let's see. Jackson Holiday, and it is a Jason Dominguez Aqua. That is a sharp looking card as well. Rookie debut, nice. So we're definitely getting some bangers out of these. Holy crap, guys. Yes. That is a huge hit right there. I would take that back. It was not a huge hit, but it's definitely a hit. So, definitely top. That's definitely top loaded worthy. He's definitely a key rookie in this set for sure. Um, okay, guys. Um, I might have to do a part two. My phone is about ready to die. I'm going to have to do a part two, guys, later on Saturday evening. Um, this is the last pack. Um, like I said, I'll have to do a part two. Nice young Hu Lee, rookie debut. Um, like I said, I might do part two. Uh, like I said, my phone's about ready to die. Um, kind of sucks. I want to keep this going. do have a Corbin Burns on the 89. And, you know... The deal Matt chat my favorite cards of the rip and a zach deloach on the rookie aqua to end that blaster number uh three i'm wondering if i should cut this short i hate to cut it short and continue this maybe saturday evening guys um but yeah i'm gonna have to my phone is about ready to die so i think i'm gonna have to pause or stop the video or continue part two later because like i said um didn't realize my phone was gonna be dying so quick 
Um, so yeah, let's continue this in part two. We still have blasters four and five. As you can see, a quick little recap for this first video. Amazing hits. And Nelson Velasquez on the Independence Day. The uh, Pete Crow Armstrong to 999. Nice color match. The Adam out of Ottavino to 25. The camo and the hit probably so far of the rip is the Paul Skeens Aqua. Stay tuned for part two, guys. Sorry this took a little bit longer. I'm just soaking it all in and just enjoying this rip it's been absolutely amazing straight fire wow i just i can't wait to get into blasters four and five stay tuned guys hope you guys enjoyed this first video of part one stay tuned for part two